Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, children of all ages, welcome to Marshall GTV2. My name is Marshall. I'd like to thank you. This is the second in the series. I guess I'm going to do a series. I don't know. We'll see. But this one is going to be basic secondary modding for beginners. Now for that, what we're going to use, and let me get up to the market so I can show it to you. Uh, let me see. We're going to use the Furious because that comes in fairly quickly. It's a mastery rank two, of course, and blueprint only costs 15 and it's not extremely cheap to build, but it's not too bad. You only need, you do need four neuros, which are kind of problematic, but everyone can get it. So we're using that one. My Furious actually has four forma in it. Let me show you that right now. And we're going to be going very, very, very basic, like we did with the melee weapon, with the Galatine when we did that before. Now it's kind of a little different. I can't remember if it comes with one V or one dash. I believe the one dash, but that's neither here nor there. We're, it's just a basic, basic automatic gun. And if you're like me, sometimes aiming is troublesome and that's okay. So we're gonna go over the four basic ones that you can get. These two are kind of difficult to get, but I'll go over how to get those as well. But uh, let's go ahead and get into the simulacrum or simulacrum in order to test this out. And give me one second and I will be right there. All right, here we are in the simulacrum and I have my little Furious. This is not the Mark I Furious. You can do that as well if you want to. I can't remember what that one is. I leveled that particular gun up way early ago. The reason why I keep this and the reason why I ended up doing so many forma on the thing is because it, this particular gun, you can get an augment for it. Augments, in case you're wondering, are actually available in the sanctuaries. This one is from New Loca. It's just a life steal that fills up your life bar if you shoot it a lot and it works it's a it's a fun little gun so let's get back to the basic mods now first one you're gonna get need to get on here is hornet strike which is just your standard basic damage build that's it nothing nothing really to sneeze at it's just your basic damage gives you 20 percent damage now the second one that you can get, this one, Augur Pact, which gives you 15% damage, that can be obtained on the plains of Eidolon. If you go out there, you'll do one or two of the easy missions. Well, when I say the easy missions, the beginning missions, excuse me. You'll get this one. This is a great, great mod. It goes on almost all of my, my secondary builds. And then we have this one, Barrel Diffusion. This one is a mess. It took me a very, very long time to obtain barrel diffusion. This is just multi-shot. Everything that's basic on thing, it doubles it. That's it. And when I say doubles it, I mean, gives you 20% more quote unquote bullets. You can't see my quoting fingers. Why am I doing it? It doesn't matter. And that this one is the most difficult of the bunch to get. You can do invasions. If you do invasions and go against the Grenier, in other words, going to do getting field drawn from the corpus. Eventually, you will get the Grustrag 3. I think that's what it's called. We'll go with that. And when you kill them, nine times out of ten, you end up getting a barrel diffusion. Usually. So you, you do enough of those invasions to get the field drawn. Yeah. Or even the weapons that they offer. You know, you'll, chances are you'll get that. So barrel diffusion. Uh, let me see here. Uh, what was I going to do? There we go. Oh. No, that's not the one. I thought I had more of that. Actually, yeah. If I do that, yeah. I have four extra ones, so... And I gave one of those away. So, that's the toughest one to get. Lethal Torrent is not extremely tough, but it is difficult. I don't have a second, there, second one of those. I have gotten two of them. I did give one of those away. And, um... Yeah, uh, I can't remember what the base stats on it are. However, where you can get the Lethal Torrent is just by going into alerts because it'll pop up on an alert. So you, you do that, you do a nightmare mission, etc. Um, 
I'll go over leveling and everything at an, probably in another video. Excuse me, but uh, what I'm gonna do for, hey, wow, that's cool. All right, let's go ahead and take that one out and take this one out and we'll just go with these two. So as you can see, 18% damage. Let me get all these out. Base, it gives you 14. 14 damage on puncture, which is nice. It works. And obviously, as you can see, I have 32 Hornet Strikes, so they come pretty frequently as soon as you get off Earth, and I believe it's off of Venus as well. You do enough missions, you'll get enough stuff, just being honest with you. So we do that, and we're going to put Augur Pact on here. I'm putting it here because of these particular polarities, as they are called. And what the polarities just do is it halves the value of your mod. So as you can see, with Hornet Strike, it's four. You put it in one of those slots that pops green when you click on it, and it has to match. That's a V. So the V polarity needs a V mod, and then it'll half it. So anyway, and of course, as we talked about in the last video, this also has a potato on it. So let's go ahead and spawn a level, I don't know, level 10 enemy. That should, that should do it. What do you think? Sounds good? I can't hear you. Come on now. I'm just kidding with you. All right, so let's do some trash enemies. We'll do five. Five of these, oh, not 15, five. There we go, there's five of those enemies. And we'll change the settings and do level, uh, let's do level 15, which is what ends up coming up on, I believe that's Venus, possibly into Mercury or Mars? Probably Mar Mars, we'll, we'll go with that. I can't remember exactly. This is the higher end of the of the uh, easier enemies in the game, so we'll go with that with a just standard thing. And of course, again, I need to actually do this every time. You know what I'm saying, man? I'm telling you. Uh, let me go ahead and take this out. Change the settings should be still the same, which they are. I'm not pausing on anything. Let's go ahead and do that. Let's go ahead and use the Furus and kill these guys. Hopefully, I don't know. Yeah, there we go, boom. It's got an okay reload. Not great. And again, these are trash, trash mob enemies. I'm shooting the body. And as you can see, it pretty much takes care of them pretty well. One, two, three, is there a fourth? Fifth one around here. Where'd he go? I guess he all. I guess he took care of them all. All right, so that's that. And let me get back up here. Whoopsie daisy. There we go. And that, as we say, is that. So that's just with what was it? Boop boop boop. Just the auger pact and the hornet strikes. So I'm going to level this these guys up just a tad. And I'll show you possibly the, the lower end of what this particular gun. You'll run out of bullets more likely than not. So this is, again, enemy level 25. We'll go with that. And we'll simulate it and see how this thing takes care of them. We do this. I'm assuming that we're going to end up getting canned. You never know. But... Whoa. Aim is trash. Okay, well, it works. Works just the fine. Oh, where are, where are you at? And these, again, these are trash enemies. Let's do a headshot. There we go. Whoopsie daisy. Come on. Me and my trash aim. Gotta love that, right? There's two. And headshots. Gotta love it. I think we got rid of them. So that, that'll take care of good stuff. So just on the base mods. Because of the amount that this particular gun fires, it does pretty well. Uh, let me see here. So now we're going to raise these. Again, I'm just using like the basic trash mobs. Uh, let's go ahead and raise it. This is going to kill us, but we'll go 40, level 40. Do that a little, one more time. And then I'll put on the other two mods. Well, at least bar Barrel Diffusion. There we go. Let me go ahead and 
Got that. Good, good, good. Boom, boom. Hello. As you can t see, it actually does, uh, still does a little bit of damage. And again, these are level 40s, and these are the trash mods again. Let's do the, get some headshots going. Maybe, perhaps. There we go. Come on, buddy. Where are you going? Where are you going? Where are you? Hey. I'm talking to you, buddy. Oh boy, I just did a voice. Sorry. <laughs> I'm not apologizing. Oh, I saying I just did. Oh, there we go. So that's that. Uh, now I'm just gonna change one, put one more mod on, and that will be the barrel diffusion. And why did I do that? I don't know. Let me type this in here. Barrel diffusion. There we go. Just for argument's sake, now we have 22 damage. I'm going to go ahead and take care of these guys again. And you'll see it kind of does a little bit better in the way of damage. Get that, there we go, there we go, beautiful, done. All right, let's do it. Wow, actually didn't do much better. Oh boy, headshots, Marshall, headshots. There we go. Crits work better. So if you can do a headshot, again, I'm actually, I'm gonna hang my head in shame already because I'm actually using a controller. What can I say, I'm a console gamer and playing with a keyboard hurts my hands. All right, and wasn't there one more? Where'd you go? Really? Okay, so it did a little bit better, but now, as we level these up, and since I don't have a lethal torrent that's unleveled, I'm not going to use it, so sorry. Sorry, sorry, eh? And we'll totally level that one up, and Hornet Strike have it at the second to the highest level. So let's go. As you can see, it does about 100 damage, I believe. Was it? Uh, yeah, well, 100, 120. Oh no, I think it just said 100. Hold on, let me see if it, if it does it. No, it doesn't do it on this one. Okay, that's cool. So 120 damage puncture, so here we go. Alright, and let's go ahead and get these guys done here. Simulate. Boop. And I didn't do the... Since I didn't do the lethal torrent, I'll show you what that does here in a moment. There we go. Done. Oopsie. How about that? Just like that. Just those three, three mods. So that's your basic bread and butter. Let me go ahead and throw on the lethal torrent on here and I will show you on one of my builds in a moment but I want to show you what the lethal torrent does because it gives you 60% more multi-shot on top of what you already have so as you can see it does 150 now 152 damage so it gave me gave me another 30 33 damage roughly so let's go ahead and do that, and it also gives me 60% more fire rate, which I, I like the fire rate on this now. One, two, three, whoops, almost took care of all of them. One clip. Wasn't there another guy? Where'd he go? Hello? Is that all of them? I think that was all of them. No? Oh, here he is. I hear him. There he is. Hi, buddy. There we go. So you can be trash at aiming and it'll still work, still work pretty well. Now I will show you one of my, oops, not that one, I did that again. <laughs> now I'll show you one of my builds. This one is for corrosive, don't I have one for, yes I have one for radiation as well. But we'll show you, well since it's, since it's Grenier, you use radiation for Grenier, heated and thing after you do the after you get these all down, leveled up, etc., then 
you'll go for some of the extra mods. Right now the way I have it set up is so I can have some radiation against the Grenier. I have Pistol Pestilence for a little more status, and as you can see it gives me 45% status, so every, roughly every second bullet it'll proc a status effect. In this case, radiation, which will go right through, I think it's alloy armor that the Grenier have. And as you can also see here, we have two times critical multiplier. Now we don't have much of a critical chance, but eh, I don't really care. It's not that big of a thing. This one's roughly more for this, which is the augment that I was talking about before. This one gives me lifesteal at its highest level. And this one, like I said, you can get when you go through uh, new loca. Uh, it's on the right side of the st of the of the syndicates, and that's at the front of your ship. So, let me go ahead and demonstrate this one real quick. And by real quick, I mean not very quick at all. Ha <laughs> ha. Okay, we're gonna do five lancers, not fifteen. We'll do five lancers. And whoop, get rid of those guys. And we're gonna do some settings here. Uh, let me pump, pump those guys up to 50 so they can actually do some damage to me. Again, this is 50 is more like um, near the end of the star chart. I'm just letting you know. So, chances of you running into these guys won't be for some time. And by that time, you'll have all your leveled mods and you'll branch out. So, let me see what we can do here against these guys. All right. Whee! Yes, it's necessary. All right. One down. As you can see, my health is staying up because they will damage the ever living, you know what, out of me. See, it like that, right there. Oh, oh, they're gonna get me. There we go. But I also have the syndicate proc on this, so that's kind of cool. And is that it? Oh, here we go. And we're done. So, Lifesteal. It's a great, great mod. If you get a chance, if you decide to go on the right side, then, or if you know someone that has one of those that can, you can trade for, by all means. I'm always in the mood to trade this because I still don't have the Steel Meridian Hex Syndicate Augment, which I really, really want. And if you want to, hit me up you want to trade one of those if you have it but if not you know and if you're just a beginner checking these videos out by all means I appreciate it I thank you guys for coming in I saw that my first video has more views than I've gotten on any of my videos in over a year so that's cool thank you guys for checking that out and my first video in the melee yeah that got 10 views but that's it's pretty cool I'm really excited about that actually I haven't done one of these in a long time so I hope that some of this you found useful. If so, by all means, uh, let me know down in the comments if you want to. Or, you know, hit that like button if you want to see more. That'd be cool. Subscribe. Hey, that would be neat. You don't have to if you don't want to. That I understand completely. But other than that, I do thank you guys so much for watching. And, yeah, I still don't have a sign-off. So, Trash YouTuber, signing off. And have a good day. Bye now. Peace. Okay, I'm going this time. Later.